unexpectedly is that Mr. Ruiz, who we just heard in the pregame interview, had some car trouble on the way up. Hope all was working out well there. Here's Hernandez's kick, and we're underway. He'll be taken at about the 15-yard line by Nicholas Jackson. Jackson can scoot across the 35 to the 40 before he's shoved out of bounds. Stuart Franks is listed as a free safety. Carlos West at 1 DB. Melvin Strong, Reggie Banks, and rounding things out is the other safety, Malcolm Cooper. Snap in the first play of the game from scrimmage is a run. It's stuffed right at the line of scrimmage by San Antonio. Either side, one wide receiver out wide on each side. Motion man, they will keep it on the ground. Tripped up short of the... We'll see him in the second half, perhaps. Hard to miss him down there. Oh, yeah. Listed 495 pounds. Third down throw is complete. Still have some yards to go. They're not going to get there. A heat-seeking down... Unless the penalty, the penalty might have happened before that first play. That's my guess, yeah. That okay. would make sense. Yeah, so that first play didn't actually count. There you go. So here's third down, and we'll call it four. Snap. Pressure comes. Running for his life. Gets away. And the throw knocked away. Incomplete. 30-31 loss. They had a 49-12 win, a 31-0 win, and then a 20-18 loss. So they haven't won a close game yet this season. We'll see if... They can pull away early against Leander off a good punt, high up in the air. And that will take a Wolfpack roll inside the 20, all the way down to about the 13-yard line. That's a nice shot. Here's a Wolfpack here in Week 5 of Craft League action on KMAC Sports. This game is on KMAC Sports twice tonight. I'll explain that after this play <laughs> here. Olvera give to Valle. Valle surging through. It's a nice run on first down. He's near the first. Back to KMACsports.com. Click on the link and choose the Leander broadcast and hear your guys with the call. Two receivers up top, just one defender covering them. But the Warriors try to keep this one on the ground on second and short. They only had a couple inches, 24-yard line. Jonathan Spires in on that last stop for the Wolfpack. And Warriors spread the field with three receivers. Old Vera back to pass for the first time. Throws to the near side, caught by Fisher. Fisher looking for the yards after the catch. Stretches the ball out to the 45-yard line and has a first down. Be there more often than not. For San Antonio. First and 10 from the 45 yard line. About five minutes off the clock here in the opening quarter. No score yet. Olvera gets the snap, gives left side. Osmond breaks a tackle across midfield into Wolfpack territory. Brought five coming right. from the, uh, the quarterback's right side, and the handoff went to the offense's left side. So that helps. Run where they aren't. Second and two for San Antonio. Olvera under pressure, heaves it to the right side. A jump ball, it's tipped up in the air, incomplete. Ooh. Well down and two. I formation for San Antonio. Two receivers to the right, one to the left. Olvera under center. Perhaps trying to draw them off. Nope, now they'll motion and move into a shotgun formation. Wolfpack showing blitz. Olvera gets the snap. Looking to his left. Throwing to his left. That's incomplete. Coming after it. Big play. Fourth and two. Need to get it to the Wolfpack 45-yard line for a fresh set of downs. Olvera. There's some motion along the line. Olvera keeps it. There was no whistle. Flags fly flags. now, and Olvera should have had the forward progress to the 45-yard line. Another division. This is one of those crossover games for San Antonio. Their other one will be the final week of the season against the San Marcos Bobcats. i will be on the road. First and ten for the Warriors. Trying to get deeper into Wolfpack territory as Olvera gets the snap. Flush to his right. Now lets it rip. Has a man. Incomplete. They're running the clock. Yeah, which is odd. It's still early in the game. Keep it moving. But the Warriors should have a stop clock here. Pitch play to the right side, trying to set up a block. And here's Osman. He doesn't get anything going. Ushered out of bounds, but going for it on fourth down. Opens up a lot more things. Warriors spread the field with four receivers, two on either side. So Vera moves Osman from his right shoulder to his left. Gets the snap. Gets a three-man rush. Running to his left. Needs to get rid of it. Olvera in the, in the grasp. Escapes. Throws it up for grabs. Intercepted. Intercepted by Leanders. They come back the other way with blockers. To the 40, 35, 30. Just one man to beat. Trying to reverse field. A couple men bring him down. But that's a... You know, you get, in, you get into a situation where one team is going to be trying to come from behind at some point. They're going to want some of that time and back. They're going to want that time back. Yeah, the clock is, is still going. We're under four minutes to go now in the first quarter. I don't think it's the same guy who was running the clock for our youth game earlier. 
on this very field. Great pressure by the Warriors. In trouble. And there's a sack. All the way back at the... We'll see what the Wolfpack go with here. Tramel Wilno. Under center. Some extra blockers in against this tough Warriors front. Snap. They'll pitch it. Have a hole. And it closes quickly. Trying to feed Eddie Bailey Jr. again. Interception return. Right. Suddenly the defense is the one that's gaining, uh, in a way, plus yards. Third down and a mile for the Wolfpack. Two receivers to the right, one to the left for Wilno. Gets the snap. Blitz comes again. Has some time. Now that time has run out. He's running for his life. Flings it to the right side incomplete. And that brings up fourth down. Uh, this first quarter will be over in record time right. if they don't. Punt is away. Guerra sends it off. This one not quite as hard, but it does take another Wolfpack roll and will be downed at about the 25-yard line. Stadium here tonight and a gorgeous night for football here in the Craft League. San Antonio Warriors, first and ten in the I formation. Olvera gets the snap. Stumbles is able to give it off. Left side and some running room. A first down run for, I believe that's Reggie. Quite right. <laughs> at least we would hope so. But they'll let them run this play. Snap to Olvera. Steps up in the pocket. Fires a deep pass. Has Fisher. Throws oh. hands. Incomplete. Les Clary, our QA, back at Mission Control. Warriors have second down and 15. Try the little reverse play with some running room. To the near side, 40, 45, 50. Stretching it out. First down yardage and delivering the... You're right, he was pointing at the running back. First and 15. And keep it on the ground. Run right into some white jerseys for a gain of just... Receivers to the right, one to the left. Run middle. Again, nothing doing. Looks like the fullback that time. Whenever the Warriors have been dropping back to pass, there's been just a split second of time, and that's been about it. Yep. And that changes some of the math in terms of thinking about what the play call is going to be. From the shotgun here, it's Olvera. Flanked by running backs with three receivers. High snap, gets to it, has some time, fires to the right side. That's a jump ball, and it's intercepted. Finally taken down back at the 15 quarter, number two. The clock running again. I don't understand the clock running here. This is supposed to be NFL rules, and these are not NFL clock uh, running. Pitch play to the right side with some blockers. Tripped, stumbled for the Wolfpack. Eye formation again. Run right into the teeth of the Warrior defense. A third and ten. It'll be Wilno in the shotgun. He's got Xavier Peoples to his right. Peoples was the receiver on that last play. Here it is, third and long, a flag thrown. Throw over the middle, caught. First down at this stand. Got just demolished by penalties on their last time out. And now, third possession, spreading the field, starting to sling the rock around. Wilno gives this to the running back, and he's gobbled up. Nothing. Starting to get banged up a little bit over the course of the season. Some more guys stepping up. Next man up sort of mentality. Second down. 13 yards to go. Empty backfield. This ball thrown out to the right side. Complete. Now trying to get the yards after catch. Flat outputs this year. 31, 49, 31. And then last week just 18. They trust their defense so much. Is this a handoff for Leander? Warriors brought some pressure. Couldn't get there with the initial surge. Football back in pretty decent field position following a punt. Got to return one of these punts, though. You got yeah. a couple guys back who've run away from punts. But you're right. The stop comes first. Empty backfield for Wilno. Wilno steps up. Has a little bit of time. Lofts it to the left side. Let his man too far. Incomplete. Fourth down. Three Warriors back to return this punt. They want to make sure they get <laughs> hands on it here. Two guys back at the 40, one guy back at the Leander 45. Punt is away off the foot of Guerra. And it will again bounce, but the Warriors will take it from their own 40. A block, and here comes Anderson. Anderson breaks a tackle. 40, 30. Hurdles over the punter. Down to the 10-yard line. Trust Olvera after two interceptions the first two drives. Or do you keep letting him go? Olvera under center. Gives this off to the running back. 
who spun down in the backfield. No gain that time. Looks like that was Frazier again from the 13-yard line. San Antonio goes from right to left across the field at Brooks Collegiate Academy. Olvera gives it off again, and again the defense arrives very quickly. The baller spiked it. That could be construed as a delay of game or unsportsmanlike. So now it's third and long. Warriors third and goal from the 18. The only bias penalty right there. Well, they're in the shotgun moving some backs around. It's just a three-man rush. Jump ball to the end zone. Caught. Touchdown, Warriors. What a play. What a catch. Perfect throw, but a beautiful play. And catch can really wait until that thing is just inches off the ground. That's where Fisher caught it. Just inches off the ground. Extra point attempt, wobbly, but it is good. Going here, they've struggled against a mighty Warrior defense. Hernandez's kick, off to the right side, fielded about the 18-yard line. Now reverse field, take it to the left side, across the 30, 35, 40. 45, spins off a tackle, reaching near midfield. A nifty return for Dominic Packer. Well, so we'll see what the Wolf Pack can do, playing from behind now. First and 10 from their own 30 or 48-yard line. It's Wildno under center. Pitch play. They'll reverse it. One broken tackle into Warrior territory. Of well, that's one thing you can do against an aggressive defense. Yep. Is try to get them just chasing you too much, and then you reverse it on them. Like you said, good discipline. Second down. Call it four with four minutes to go. Run straight up the middle. Couple yards there, perhaps. Right. A first down for this Wolfpack offense would, would go a long way for them and just and just their confidence a little bit. Have just one first down so far in this game. Empty backfield now for Wildno. Gets the snap, pressure comes, flips it over the middle, incomplete, looking for a flag there. KMAX Sports, bringing your teams to you for 14 years. Wolfpack come out of the timeout, and they decide they're going for it. Spread the field with five receivers. Under pressure, Wildno gets away, tucks it, tries to run, he's in trouble, he's going to come up short, and the Warriors get the turnover on downs. Turnover here early on this possession. Already seen a couple interceptions thrown by Olvera. Does have that one beautiful touchdown dime as well. As the Wolfpack have made a concerted effort to stop the run. Let's see if they can keep stopping the pass. Olvera steps up in the pocket. Flushed, he will tuck it and run, has some running room. Taken down from behind, but gets eight yards. Pathetical two-minute warning. <laughs> Had some interesting clock keeping here tonight, ladies and gentlemen. If you're just joining us, seven nothing Warriors. Snap to Olvera. Pressure comes. Flings it to the right side. Caught. First down. Pushed out of bounds at about the thirty. Let's see Anderson in the slot. Receiver on the far side is Fisher. Let's see if they let him go one on one. No, they throw it to the left side. Anderson makes the catch. Comes back to the ball. Now needs to get back to the line of scrimmage. He's upended. And that's a flag for a dangerous tackle. Colby Humphrey there. That that was a three receivers to the right this time. Lone receiver on the left side is Owens. Motion Osman out of the backfield. So it's just Olvera as he lobs it to the left side. Has his man. It's caught. Touchdown, Warriors. It is for the PAT. Again, NFL rules. This is a 33-yard attempt. Jamie Hernandez to try to make it 14-0. Snap the hold by Teague. It's a low kick. It might have gotten tipped, and it comes up short. Don't see a lot of uh, don't see a lot of Warrior fans. That means you're all watching the broadcast, though, and we appreciate <laughs> that. Good kick gets past the kick returner. He'll take it back at the 25-yard line, but that allows the coverage to get there. Spun down inside the 30. So the Warriors kicked off. All That's even right. So we like them a lot. Minute 34 left in the second quarter. Interesting formation. Looks like the uh, the choo-choo train on the near side. Three receivers all lined up, one behind the other. And they'll go the other way with it. Run to the left side with a burst of speed. Out of bounds to the 40-yard line. That was a straight keeper by, looked like Jamal Mays that time. Offensively. Check that the quarterback is Jason Johnson, number two. He's listed as a wide receiver, so they might run him again out of the Wildcat. First and ten from the 40. Low snap. Johnson. Pressure comes, and he's running for his life. All the way back to the 25-yard line before he's gang-tackled. A huge loss on the play of at least 15 yards. Get to midfield, and the snap will be taken at their own 15. Looking to throw over the middle. Oh. Intercepted. 
Picked off by San Antonio, and here comes Coleman. Coleman takes it back to the house. Pick six, San Antonio. A topic of conversation will come up at <laughs> halftime here in about a minute. Oh, you know, you know Coach White will mention it. Saying we've been here before. This should feel familiar. Two-point conversion attempt. Olvera over the middle. Two-point conversion. Good. Fisher on the slant. Money in the bank. As Hernandez will send this kick off into the warm night sky. Fielded about the 20-yard line. Taken by Jackson. Jackson from the 30. 35, 40. Great burst of speed. Lowering the shoulder. Upended at the 49. Kick return game. Been one of the few bright spots tonight for the Wolfpacks. Before, there aren't a lot of guys in this league with breakaway speed. He might be one of the few. Empty back set for the Wolfpack now. Down by three scores. Screen pass to the near side. It's caught by Jackson. Look out. Jackson across the 40. Jackson taken down from behind. Some pushing and shoving, but there's a whistle. And that's stopped by a host of Warriors. First and ten. 30 seconds left in the half. Wolfpack threatening to get on the board. Fake the screen. Throw the wheel route over the middle. Has a man caught at the 15. Breaks the tackle into the end zone. Touchdown, Wolfpack. Now the Wolfpack going for two out of that odd diamond formation. Pitch play right side, trying to keep the legs moving. Defense holds. From Earl Bertrand, I'm Cameron Songer. Les Clary, our QA. And they'll just go deep with it all the way back to the five-yard line where it's taken by Reggie Banks. Banks trying to go up the middle with it. Banks gets a block. He's stuffed at the 20. It took a little while for that whistle to blow. Down to just 13 seconds left in the second back to bite the Wolfpack. Warriors will spread the field here, starting from their own 21. It's already been a busy half for Olvera. Two touchdown passes, two interceptions. They might let him rip. Draw play up the middle. And there's nothing there for Carl Fourier's. After this, there will be five games left. This is game number five on the season. For San Antonio. Olvera back to pass. What could be the last play of the half? Time running out. Olvera slings it over to the right side. It's caught. Pushed out of bounds. Second half about ready to get underway, Cameron. Ernesto Guerra kicking off for Leander. And it's a surprise onside. Kicker recovers it, and that did travel to 10 yards. Football. Here we go. It's that diamond formation for Leander. Looks like Wild No is the quarterback on the right side of this formation. He's got two backs to his left. Give it to one of the fullbacks, who has a little burst of speed across the 45. Spins through, and that's close to a first down. A mass of bodies right there with you. That's right, but... but this game could come down to the wire, and you might want that timeout. Ball comes out. Warriors have stripped it. They recover it. Warriors ball. Between snaps, that's, again, peculiar for tonight's game. Olvera gets the snap, steps up against pressure, lobs it to the near side, looking for a man, batted down incomplete. Receiver so hard to get that second half going. Or even just a quick halftime, five minutes. There you go, yeah. Flag on this play. Play action. The pass is underthrown and intercepted inside the 10-yard line. The pick made by Devin Point. Two turnovers and a pass interference. Handoff. The defense was there on the exchange. On a fumble. The Warriors moving up the field thanks to a big 20-plus yard pass interference penalty. Now looking at this second down and six. Try the run game again. In the game for San Antonio's number 43, Brandon Valle. He's the deep back in the eye formation. They give it to Valle. Left side. Has a hole. Has the first down. Across the 15. Mid. Players needing to keep hydrated out there. First and 10 for San Antonio. Ball at the Wolfpack 13-yard line. Throw to the end zone. Caught. Touchdown. There it is again. Dion Anderson hauls this one in. Going quickly. They're set. Olvera with the man in motion. Boy, it's a nice long play clock. Rolling to his right. O-line looked a little confused. This ball intercepted and trying to take it back the other way. That ball pops out, and then the tackle finally made. The two-point attempt, no good. Kim it's fun, though. You, you really enjoy it. It sort of adds an element of surprise. This kicked off to about the 26-yard line. Taken on the run, reversing field. 
stumbling, bumbling all the way down to the 42-yard line. And some more contact after the play. No more whistles. Been more successful in figuring things out. Got to maintain striking distance. Receivers bunched up, one behind the other on either side. Now they motion out the running back. Empty backfield. Long pass to the far side, tipped away incomplete. Weeks ago, we've also seen some wildcat action from Jason Johnson, but he threw a pick and went for a touchdown. It was Coleman for San Antonio had an interception return. Wild no, flushed out of the pocket, running. Now throwing to the near side, caught near the 50, short of the sticks, but a nice way to come back under now with the score being where it is, that might change. Do they start being a little bit more aggressive on fourth down and going for it? They're hoping to get it here on third down. Screen pass to the near side. They have the blocking, they have the first down, they have some broken tackles. Across the 40, all the way down near the 35-yard line, it's Nicholas Jackson again. Led at halftime in every game this season. Yet they sit at 2-2 two and two on the year in Kraft League football. Empty backfield. Fake the pass. Broken tackle. Rolling to the right and just getting out of bounds this time. That time. And the window's open. Up here in the booth. Could be worse. It could be raining. Could That's be true. lightning and thunder like we had last week up in Georgetown. On a good run this time. Near the first down marker. Not quite enough on the carryoff. Bunched up again. A couple of receivers, but they're right all along the line. One running back. Quarterback right under center going with that hard count. Wild no drops back. Has time. Flings it to the left side. Miscommunication. And the receiver was no. Lined up on the left side at the 30-yard line. Two to the right. Empty backfield. Wild no gets the snap. He's immediately pressured. Completes it over the middle with the slant. And there's no one there to cover that. Dominique Packer will take it in. With one, or with... A hold, the Warriors can keep it at 15. Shotgun formation. Four guys on that left side. They go to the middle. Two-point conversion, good. 7.23 to play, third quarter. Could have been a, a thrilling Warriors win. Sure, San Antonio is now on alert for this <laughs> potential onside kick after the last one was uh, brilliant and perfectly executed by Leander's Ernesto Guerra. He tries it again. They go to the well again. The Warriors get it this time. And that's nice. Good starting field position. Sure. Last week's game coming out of that lightning delay the Warriors had. Things got sloppy for a few minutes. Olvera gives this to the fullback on the first play after the onside kick. No game. Might have even lost a yard. First season in the Crossroads League, the Craft League. Second down. Olvera throws the slant. It's up high. Tipped away. Incomplete. Trying to find... Rob Joey Fisher of anything out of Blinn College 6-3-2-15 a matchup nightmare on the outside let's see if they go to him again on 3rd and 12 Olvera drops back throwing looking for Fisher too high Incomplete have really been shooting themselves in the foot 1st and 10 for San Antonio give left side a carry this time from number 12 Kareem Muaz from Merle Bertrand I'm Cameron Songer thank you so much for joining us tonight also thanks to Les Clary our QA Five and a half minutes to go, third quarter. Warriors nursing a 13-point lead. Throw this one over the middle. I think that one was dropped. Here tonight, some of the... Yeah, not keeping a play clock in the stadium. It's being kept, kept down on the field. Olvera throwing to the end zone, looking for Fisher. Tipped around, batted down, incomplete. Crowd making some noise for both teams. Olvera from the shotgun, gets the snap, throwing. Tipped down, incomplete. The big boy play both sides of the ball. Will they still maintain their dominance in the trenches? That's one of the big questions for the San Antonio defense. Show blitz, back off it. Handoff goes up the middle. One broken tackle, two broken tackles, and here we go. 45-50, and finally shoved out of back. He's also had a handful where he's been stuffed by this tenacious warrior defense. Four and a half minutes to go, third quarter. 13-point ball game from midfield. Odd formation, give this to the first man through. Breaks one tackle, spun down at the 50. Good hard tackle in some time. Three receivers to the left, two to the right. That means nobody in the backfield with Tremel Wino. I don't know. Gets the snap. Flag flies. Flushed out of the pocket. Has a man chasing after him. Spins past a couple of Warriors. He's down near the marker. 
a good run as Darian Stets right just couldn't catch up with the fleet footed quarterback, but we have to see with the flag clock. Under three and a half to go in the third quarter. Wolfpack down by 13. Snap. While no fakes. Slings it. Caught behind the marker and spun down for just a one yard gain. That run that clock again. 2.30 left in the third quarter. Time not really a factor in this two score game. Still the third quarter. Snap. While no. Pressured. Steps up. Wrapped up. Sacked. Everybody. It's a fake. They're throwing it. Have a man. Caught first down yardage to the 25. Nifty play. The Warriors were caught sleeping. First and goal from the 10. No, it is. Looks like it is at the 12. It is at 12, yeah. Yeah, there you go. Here's a halfback pass over the middle. It's dropped. Oh, oh. Right. Halftime stretched it again to 27-6 with the first score of the third quarter. Now the Wolfpack threatening to put together back-to-back -to -back scores. Run this ball up the middle. Trying to strip it loose. The Warriors doing a great job of keeping that ball carrier going. A helmet comes off at the end of that play. That's not good for Sinek. Could be the last play of the third quarter. Under 30 seconds left in the period. Warriors up by 13 with the Wolfpack threatening. Second and goal. The snap. Wild no. Steps up. Hands on him. Breaks away from one. Gets away. Throws it. Has a man. Tiptoeing. Caught. Touchdown. down. The extra point attempt looked like that got deflected. Yep. And bounces short. No good. So the wildness of missed a PAT there just a second ago. So it's 27-20. Still anybody's ball game with the fourth quarter right around the corner. Regular kickoff this time after a few onside kick attempts. And San Antonio has some trouble with it. It's still on the turf. Booted around. Who's going to fall on San Antonio? Finally falls on it. My goodness. Deion Anderson is at the bottom of that pile. Turn it over. Right. They've had three interceptions tonight. Two of them counted. Keep this one on the ground. Nice and safe and a nice run by Valle. Valle across the 25, across the 30. Delivers the hit. And he's down by contact. First down is Clary back at Mission Control, keeping us on the air. Warriors have first and 10. And they give it off left side. Valle had a nice run just a moment ago to end the quarter. He has another good one here. As he keeps fighting forward, picks up six yards. Kicked off, it was still, it was still light out, but it's, most of the games are all played uh, after dark. That's, that's, that's the joke. Second and 15 for San Antonio. Keep it on the ground again. Valle struggling to get back to the line of scrimmage before he's swallowed up. Manuel De Leon for Leander. It'll be third and long. Unless you play a knob. Well, that's, I mean, that was guys. a Saturday night for all those folks. Hey, you got guys coming from all over the place in that region to come and make a team. Olvera throwing near the marker, comes up short as he was trying to find. But even then, it was 21-0. They gave up a score late to make it 21-6. This one is blocked and recovered by Leander all the way at the San Antonio 26-yard line. Just took too long developing. And not enough. Here come the Wolf Pack. First and 10 from the San Antonio 27-yard line. Snap. In trouble. There's a sack. Well, that helps things out. Three receivers on the right side. The lone receiver on the short side is Nicholas Jackson. Get the snap. Warriors come after the quarterback again. Flip this one off. It is incomplete. Careful. Careful. They were ready to hit that running back. Snap to Wild, though. Steps up in the pocket. Has some time. Airs it out deep. Looking for a man incomplete. Pretty good port. Big fourth down play. Fourth down and a long way to go. 20 plus. Still 11 and a half minutes to go. Drop back to throw. Wild, though. Airs it out deep into double coverage. It's intercepted by San Antonio. And coming back the other way with it. Here come the Warriors. 35 40. tiptoeing the sideline. Have to see where they mark him out of bounds, but a nice. Keep it on the ground, Olvera. Hands on now more than a full quarter without scoring points. Of course, we saw that at the beginning of the game. That went very quickly. <laughs> Hand off right side. Valle finds a hole. There's a flag on this place. He stretches to the outside. Has the first down and more to the 40, taken down near the 36 yard line. Is thrown in the end. Move fast enough. For the Warriors, they're kind of on the wrong side of the momentum right now. 
trying to string together some plays, but now looking at a second down and 20. Two receivers right, one to the left. Motion a man out. Delayed handoff. It's read well by the defense and stuffed. Yikes. Doesn't repeat itself here tonight. Very similar to the game last week. Just with more points this week. Olvera. Deep drop back. Throw it on the screen play. Picked up. Valle in trouble. He might have even dropped it at first. I'm not sure. Everyone seemed to kind of stop. Uh, excited about what they did on the last time. Let's see if they are enticed to come after it again. High snap. Fisher gets to it. Gets it away. And then gets hit. There's a flag. And it'll be returned. And now all the action's about the flag. Fisher's still down on the turf. The return all the way, the other way. No, he did step out of bounds. Entertainment product. And, and the players, I think, enjoy playing in it more, too. Hand off Valle. Up the middle. Gets a couple yards. And keeps that clock moving. Under eight minutes to go. Found some things on some, some scramble plays. I don't know how many more of those they have up their sleeve. Keep it on the ground again. Swarming around Valle. I don't think he got back to the line. He's gobbled up. Five minutes of the third quarter. Home stretch of this one. Two running backs in the backfield with Olvera. Calls for the snap. Gets it. Steps up. Has time. Pump fake. Now firing to the left side. It's caught. It's Fisher again. First down, San Antonio. Let's see if the Warriors can keep possession alive to that point. Then you really start sweating if you're a Wolfpack fan. Handoff. Trying to stretch it. Nothing doing. Valles down by contact. The arm of Olvera, this Wolfpack defense, especially the front seven, they're tightening up. Second and long. Play fake. Throw it to the near side. Almost had a one-handed catch. Wow. Great Looking effort. for Roderick Owens. In the Alamo City. Olvera in the shotgun. Got some extra blockers in. Has plenty of time. Throwing to the right. It's caught at the 30-yard line. Not enough. For Canadian rules football all of a sudden. And the Wolfpack get the football back. First and ten from their own 30. Give goes up the middle. Try right side, breaking a tackle. 30, 35, slipping past another to the 40. Breaks another tackle, 45. 16-yard run. Who's down there? It could be somebody's kid. It could be somebody's brother. I don't want to accuse anyone incorrectly, but that's where that came from. Dropping back to pass. There's a huge sack on the play. Empty backfield. Could be the last play before the two-minute warning. Wildno gets the snap. Quick swings it out to the near side. It's caught. Trying to make somebody miss. Too many red jerseys there. Sports. Just another way KMAX Sports is bringing your team to you. Final two minutes here in San Antonio. Leander with the ball. Chasing a seven-point deficit. A deep throw on third and long. There's no one home. The Warriors have intercepted it. Back at the 30-yard line. It's picked off by Banks and... Oh, did he? Did it go down? I don't think he did. And it's taken back the other way by Leander. What's the call? He, this did is not college. He could have gotten up and run that football. That should be a fumble recovery touchdown for the, about the, the uh, four downs that weren't called. But that should have been a Wolfpack touchdown. That was a live football. And the Warriors just even got evened up in the break department. After all that, the Warriors take over their own 30. They break a big run. Valle. To the 50, 45, it's a foot race. Valle to the 30. Valle all the way down to the 22-yard line. A 52-yard run by Valle. And they appear to be in that formation now. Looks like they are going to get into the formation, just try to take a snap or two. and yeah, Straight quarterback deal down by Olvera. And lot to talk about. Yeah. Uh, it's something the league should probably look at just to, just to evaluate uh, what ended up happening. Big picture, it, it evened out. You had you had two plays that evened out, and there's no guarantee that you know if things played out correctly, 
Because basically, you, you ended up with the same spot almost. Right. Uh, the Warriors getting the ball somewhere between the 20 and 30 yard line. Uh, they would have had to on the next play. Leander is going for it. They have to go the length of the field in very little time. There's going to have to be a Hail Mary at some point. There was a they call this a fourth down play. <laughs> Uh, the Warriors do have to snap the ball one more time here, it looks like, on third down. And that, that will end the game. But 